Okay, we're going to take a look at how we can use Power Query in Excel to generate a list of all file names from a given folder and all of its subfolders. So in this example, we've got a folder set up here, right here, and within that folder I have a couple different files and they're actually all different types of files. So we have some uh, Microsoft Access and Excel files and text files, etc. And then in a subfolder within that folder, I've got the same type of thing. So another bunch of files and there's a further subfolder in there. And what we're going to do is use Power Query. So in the Data tab, that's under get and transform data and we're gonna go to the get data icon and under from file we'll find the from folder option and if we select that we can then input our folder path so I'm just gonna go up here and copy and paste that and paste it right in there and you can also use this browse button to find your folder path and I'm just gonna press the OK button and then we can edit And now if you wanted to, you could actually filter on specific types of files. So maybe I only want to see Excel files here and I could have that show and then I can close and load this data. Uh, but let's just show everything. And we'll go and close and load this to a table and we're just gonna pick the existing worksheet, so worksheet one, and it's gonna load this up. And now here you can see we've got our file name and extension and some other cool data like the date it was modified last and the date it was created and here we can see the folder path so if we just scroll over a bit this is actually a pretty long folder but you can see that I've got my files from the initial folder and then the files from all the subfolders down here so that's how we can use Power Query to get uh, an inventory of all our files in a given folder and its subfolders and that's super easy and basically was just two or three clicks